Hey everybody, it's Jenna. So today, I wanted to go over the nine questions that were asked me on my technical phone interview. This was my first um, web developer interview, and I want to go over it. So, the position was for a front-end designer, is what it said. And based on the description, they were looking for a web designer, developer, hybrid, which is fine because I come from a design background, so that is something that I'd be able to handle. So the beginning of the interview, they asked the generic questions like, tell me about yourself, how do you deal with the difficult situation, stuff like that. And then they sent me a Google Doc, and I had about 15 minutes to complete it. And there were nine questions and a couple sub-questions. So here they are. The first question was, how do you optimize a website's assets and resources? Question two, what is the difference between a document load event and a document DOM content loaded event. Question three, what's the difference between put and post in a REST architecture? Question four, write a method that outputs to the console the odd numbers from an arbitrary starting number to an arbitrary ending number while maintaining as close to O N or better O N slash two computational efficiency and O one memory space complexity as possible. Question five write a method that will output to the console H on multiples of three and output R on multiples of five and output HR on multiples of three and five. Otherwise, output the number. Yeah. Question 5.1. What is the computational and memory complexity of your previous solution in seven described in the big O notation? Question six. Write a utility method that will determine if a given string is a palindrome. Please note that A1 BB1.A is considered a valid palindrome in this algorithm. Question 6.1 What is the computational and memory complexity of your previous solution in 7 described in the big O notation? Question seven, explain the pros and cons of an array versus a linked list. Question eight, um, eight. What is UX design? Why does it matter? And what is your UX design process? Question nine, what UI security performance, SEO, maintainability, or technology considerations do you make while building a web application or site? Okay, so those are the nine questions. In my opinion, some of them were a little bit more difficult than I think the job actually would have been if I would have gotten it. Basically, I kind of bombed this interview. But when you go in an interview, you're going on the interview also for practice. So even though I didn't do so well on this interview, now I have a better idea of what to expect on the next one. And I know the types of questions that might be asked. So I really hope that this video gives you a better idea of what to expect when you go on an interview. So if you found this video helpful, please like it and share it and comment down below and let me know how your interviews have gone. And if you're new to this channel, please subscribe. This channel is all about following an aspiring developer myself 
on my journey into getting that first web developer job. Thanks for watching.